Welcome back to another episode in Proverbs, and this is Proverbs 26. We're in our 26th day, and we're going to look at Proverbs chapter 26, verse 20. It says, where there is no wood, the fire goes out, and where there is no talebearer, strife ceases. I want to give you uh, a thought for today or a nugget on don't let it go out. Don't let your fire go out. Uh, The scripture says where there is no wood. Wood in this scripture would represent anything that is solid, anything that will fuel your faith. And so in this time of uncertainty, in this journey that we're on, one of the wisdom nuggets here in this Proverbs is that you've got to continually ignite the fire of your day, of your week, of your life. Don't let uh, the place of being comfortable or getting familiar with where you are, let your fire go out. You've got to constantly use your faith as fuel. Fuel represents that wood, that solid, that tree. In other words, that thing that will continue to cause a spark and continue to cause the flame and the fire of God to burn in your life. And so I want to encourage you today, always put in you that which would keep your fire going. Put that faith, put that word. Faith comes by hearing and hearing the word of God. What you meditate on, what you declare is that wood. It's that fuel for the fire that God can use you. The fire is the booster into your next season and into that place that God has for you. And so I want to encourage you today, make sure you continue to fuel your fire. Make sure you continue to study, continue to pray, continue to read, continue to walk and declare by faith what God's word has said pertaining to you in this hour. Don't let it go out. Don't let it be dwindled. Don't let negativity, don't let media, and don't let someone else hinder and damper what God is igniting in your life. Stay fired, stay ignited, and stay renewed. Be blessed. This is your Revelation Moment in Proverbs, and stay tuned for day 27. Bye for now.